Hey, what's going on? Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Travis Patel. In this video, I'm just gonna give you a quick explanation of the Facebook Pixel and what it's about. Now, since we're doing Facebook advertising, we wanna make sure that we can track and record as much information as possible. That's really the advantage that Facebook offers. We have a huge amount of people we can reach, but more importantly, we can really dial in on that data. We can dial in on who those people are more than any platform out there because of the way they have their system set up. And one major piece of this, and one major piece that's going to really be a huge advantage to your business and to your advertising on this platform is their pixel, as they call it, the Facebook pixel. Now, it's been a lot of controversy over the past year or so because they've been switching up how they do their system, how they're doing this pixel system. So some people are using an old method which as you can see just on the front page here of the pixel dashboard um, conversion tracking pixel and parentheses it says old that's the old system where we could set up individual pixels for any page we want any you know product or whatnot now they put all the data into one single pixel so from now on you're just gonna need to worry about a master Facebook pixel so this is the first time you're in the ad dashboard in the pixel area you're gonna go ahead and want to create a new pixel which I'm sure right right when you have a new account it'll have create pixel I think on the right here maybe under the actions here not sure exactly but it'll just be you know the base map Master Pixel won't have to do anything but name it. We call it ours MB3 Empire Advertising, even though we should probably change that to 19th. I'm gonna do that actually. 19th Advertising Pixel, so it's more specific. Master, there we go. Now we have the pixel created, and like I said, you're gonna be able to collect a ton of information once you get this pixel installed on your site, on your Shopify store, whatever it may be. From here, we can start to track who are the people from Facebook that are viewing your pages, who are the people that are adding your products to their cart if you're using an e-commerce store, who are the people purchasing the products, and so much more. If you're generating leads and getting um, email newsletters built and things like that you can uh, collect the information of who those people are that are actually you know joining your email list becoming a lead and this allows us to dial in our targeting dial in our information um, with the advertising message we have and another advantage that it really provides is the optimization the whole advantage of Facebook ads and letting their system their algorithm and their pixel do the work for you is that it's collecting all this data it sees millions and billions of people around the world and how they interact with different things and they can take those numbers that statistics that optimization and really show your ad to the exact people who are gonna buy because they want people buying your products if you have good advertising you have a good business and good brand because that's only gonna make them more and make it a better experience for their users so this optimization behind the pixel is really where it's at and a lot of this gets into more of an advanced type of advertising advanced Facebook side of things where I'm very green when it comes to the Facebook pixel myself and the optimization and all the different manipulation that you can do with this side of it but I just, at the very basic level you need to know that the Facebook pixel is super important if you plan on advertising doing paid advertising especially on Facebook so get this installed ASAP. Um, you may need to hire a developer or a coder who can go in and add all the proper events. I have some videos posted uh, on the site here that will show you the basic walkthrough for your WordPress installation, for Shopify installation, or anything like that. But this is something that you definitely need in, on point going ASAP so that you can have Facebook optimizing your ads, so you can be creating the correct audiences and showing your product and your, your sales message, your promotion message to the right people. So the Facebook Pixel, get it installed, get moving on it, and you can roll from there. So thanks guys, if you have any questions or comments, hit me up. My name is Travis Patel, take it easy.